Hello, this is Miss Chapman. In this video, we're going to find out how to complete an assignment in Teams. So how to find where your assignment is, how to complete your assignment, and then how to upload the assignment so that your teacher can mark it. First of all, go to teams.microsoft.com and click on one of the options. You can either use the, the app or you can do it on the web. You will need to log in using your login details. If you don't have your login details anymore, you can get your parents to ring the school on 0121 464 5662 or they can email the school at inquiry at moregreenacademy.org and then your teacher or somebody from the office can get in touch and remind you. Once you are in Teams, you will see a box. That box will have the name of your class in it. The name of the class will be different from the name that's in the coloured box. So just make sure you look underneath the coloured box for your class and click on. That will take you into your class channel. Once you're in your class channel, click on Assignments. You'll see that at the top of the page or along the left hand side of the page. Once you are on the assignments page, you can see all of the assignments that your teacher has set for you. Each assignment will also have the day and the time that the assignment is due to be finished by. Click on each assignment for more details and to get started. The assignment might be a quiz or a Word document for you to edit and finish. If it is a quiz, it will usually be multiple choice. So you're given a choice of three or more different answers. Simply click on the answer that you think is correct. If your assignment is a Word document, then you can open it and you can edit like you would on Word. So you can type in answers or highlight words that you think are the correct answer. You can respond in sentences or single words to lots of different types of questions. You might also have some text in there to read, such as a story or instructions, or even a poem, which is the example on this film. When you have finished the quiz, you can click on the button at the end to submit your answers to your teacher. Your teacher can then see how you got on. They can see which answers you got right and which answers you got wrong and that will help them to plan for your next lesson and your next assignment. When you have finished a Word document and have edited it to have your answers, simply close it and then click on Hand In to send the assignment to your teacher for marking. By closing it you will have saved your answers and your teacher will be able to see how brilliantly you have done. Your teacher will then be able to offer you any help with questions that you found more difficult. Always remember the internet rules of safety. Never share any personal information online. Never ask anybody to give you their phone number or address and never share your information with others. If there's something that you see online that makes you feel worried or uncomfortable, always tell an adult straight away. And when you are on the internet, it's always best to have an adult nearby to help you. Sometimes homework can be tricky to do on your own. So having the support of your parent or carer can really help if you need it. Have fun on Teams!